Today we're going to be taking a trend and plunge measurement using a silver Sunto compass clinometer. In order to be able to define the orientation of a lineation, we need to be able to define two features. First is the trend, or the orientation that the lineation is dipping towards relative to north. And the second is the plunge, or the maximum angle of dip for the lineation. So I'm going to be demonstrating this today on a book rather than an outcrop. The book cover is a planar structure, so this strike and dip symbol indicates the orientation of it. But here we also have a secondary feature, we have a lineation, which is going at a different angle to our strike and dip. So it can be really helpful to have a hardcover notebook to be able to take um, trend and plunge measurements. I'm going to be demonstrating with that today. So line up the edge of your field notebook with the lineation and make sure that your notebook is vertical. Then put the long edge of your compass clinometer against the notebook, keeping it as flat as possible, and rotate the azimuth dial until your magnetic arrow is inside the red arrow, or red in the shed. From a bird's eye perspective, I'll show that again, we're going to line up the long edge of our field notebook with the lineation, make sure it's vertical, then put the long edge of your compass clinometer against the notebook, keeping it as flat as possible, and rotate the azimuth dial until your magnetic arrow is inside the red arrow, or red in the shed. We're going to read the trend from the direction that the lineation is dipping towards. This lineation is dipping towards the southeast, so we're going to take our azimuth reading from this marker. The trend in this case is 115 degrees. Now we're going to measure the plunge. So line up east and west with your azimuth markers to use your clinometer. Put the long edge of your compass against your lineation. Make sure that your compass is vertical so that your clinometer needle is able to swing freely. When we get a little bit closer, we can see here that the plunge is 16 degrees. So putting that together, we have a trend of 115 degrees, a plunge of 16 degrees, for a lineation that is dipping 16 degrees towards 115.